are you? So, you might be wondering, why would anyone want to shorten long faces? Well, let's take a look at this picture of celebrity faces. Well, there's no doubt these are all drop-dead gorgeous women. Generally speaking though, shorter and rounder faces appear more cute, youthful, and approachable, while longer faces appear more mature, sultry, and seductive. They just give different vibes. It's even more apparent when you compare the Hadid sisters' faces. Bella has more of a mature, edgy look, which creates a strong visual impact, making her face super memorable. While everything about Gigi screams classic beauty, she's what you would consider a traditionally beautiful girl. Honestly, they're both gorgeous and I've been back and forth with this. I can't decide whose style I like more. If I look like either one of the sisters, I would not close the door when I take it them. You know what I mean? Let's take a look at a few more examples from different races. If you have a longer face but would like to shorten it to match a particular outfit on a particular day, then in today's video, I've got a few tips for you. Subscribe! Tip number one, avoid highlighting your nose bridge with a long straight line. Let's take a look at this visual example. So my nose looked much shorter on the right. This is because the contour is broken up into three parts, under my brows, side of my nose bridge, and the side of my nose tip. For a pointier tip, make a line above your nose tip to create that button nose illusion. Tip number two, do not skip lower eye makeup. Lower eye makeup will create the illusion that the position of your eyes is lower than they actually are. You can apply eyeshadow, eyeliner, and mascara to draw attention to the bottom half of your eyes. At the same time, try to avoid too much makeup on your upper eyes. Tip number three, where you apply blush makes all the difference in the world. When you want to shorten your face, you want to put the blush in the center of your face, underneath your eyes, not on your cheekbone. While putting blush on your cheekbone will accentuate your bone structure and create that high fashion look, it does make you look a bit older and more mature. When you want to shorten your face and create that more youthful and cute look, what you want to do instead is place the blush in the center of your face underneath your eyes, like right here. You want to make sure the blush is not outside of your cheekbone, but like inside. I hope you can see how drastic the difference is. You can even go over your brows, make a C over here, go over your nose a little bit, your chin. You can even go over your nose bridge to create that soft e-girl look that is so popular right now. Let me show you. Just like this. The color on your nose bridge will break up the visual into two parts and making it even shorter. Tip number four. I feel like this is a more obvious one. Your brow shouldn't be too high. So if I draw my brows higher on this side, just to let you see what the difference is and cover up the bottom part a little bit. Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like this is more comedic than educational at this point, but you get what I mean, right? So if I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna cover up the side of my face and then this side. And this side looks so much shorter. All right, so this is the end of the video. Try it out, let me know how it goes. If you find this useful, subscribe. I'm pretty new to YouTube and need all the help I can get. And let me know in the comment below which Hadid sisters facial features you like more. I'm like genuinely curious. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.